Hello, everyone. I am Dr. Agon Fires. This is Song of Horror. Okay, we're back. Now, we have a hiding place. We have this horrific thing. We have a door. And we have this. Much as I would prefer not to, we're gonna do it. Entering the second on the one dream. Hand, I just want to get out of here. But on the other, I need to know what's happening. I need to understand the dreams this place causes in me. And the visions I've had these past few days. On the one hand, I just... It's pitch black outside. And the old mansion is even more menacing than before. I've taken out my last two candles, but lighted only one. In case I wake up before dawn. It would terrify me to be here, alone in the dark. Second dream. All right, Berenice. Let's see what horrible things are going on here. Is this the same dream? It looks uh, fairly similar so far. We still have this uh, boarded up door and a phonograph, which is marvelous. Ah, you see, the uh, the walls appear more slippery this time, if I'm not mistaken. There is no sky, no horizon, just darkness. Yeah, we're in a void. <laughs> we are in the void. We have some musical instruments. Let's see what's out here. See how squishy it is. Hospital, it can't be real, right? Actually, you know, fairly squishy. <laughs> okay. What in the world's going on here? Hmm. Okay. Death is everywhere in this place. It does look pretty, uh, pretty horrific. There's something scratching around over here. And there's, of course, a, uh, a body over that way. You, you are me. Are you Berenice? Wake up. I need to wake up. Oh God, I need to wake up. Let's not even go there. Every single bottle contains poison. This kind of fell apart. All right, this is pretty, uh, <laughs> pretty miserable. Look at all this. All right, so let's head this way. Investigate these things and see where it gets us. Uh, my god, is this our fate as well? Not if I can help it, Berenice. Well, actually, no, you're already... <laughs> You've already been consumed by the darkness. Greetings. It's as if those instruments had been out in the open for 100 years. Well, nearly 80, anyway. Mm -hmm. There's a lock on the gate. All right. Who are you? Are you also me? The dream catcher. Give it to me. You don't need it. Future looks grim. Oh, look, we have this now. Okay. A dream catcher. Nothing bad will happen to me as long as I have this with me. And I'm going to give it to her. All right, let's do it. Should I give her my dream catcher? What will happen to me if I lose it? She seems to uh, be in fairly decent need of it. Oh, there we go. 
A mysterious key. A key found in a dream. Oh, damn. Does this key open a door or my own psyche? We're going into the uh, the realms of Bloodborne. All right, so we'll use the mysterious key. I have no choice. I must keep going. Doesn't look much better on this side. Almost all of us have heard the song, Will We End Up Like This? Rough place to be. Still hearing, hearing that scratching. Org trays sliding out and things. You know, the great stuff. The end of the road. I can't go any further. Right. Oh. Okay. We're doing this. Dr. Prestigard is not seeing patients at the moment. I'll have to come back at a later time. Oh, well, more she could be eaten. The doctor will see you now. Oh. To me, where am I now? All right, we were captured after we were already trapped in a dream. This is fantastic. <laughs> okay, so I see that on the wall. Anything else in here to interact with? Not at the moment. Okay. Only one way out. Only one way out. What does that mean? Not really, uh, into this right now. No. Why would I need an all for? How would it help me escape? Where did that come from? What's going on? I oh. Don't like this. All right. What? What do I pretend to do with a knife? Oh no. No, why do I have to use this noose? This can't be happening. Maybe we can resist, Doctor. There was only one way out. That was... Why would I do something like that? I know I'm closer to understanding something, to finding that last puzzle piece, but I also realize there's no turning back. I feel like I've broken something inside of me that can't be mended. Each dream feels closer to that place. And further from reality, it's still dark outside. But it seems like the candle burned out a while ago. It must be close to dawn. Yes, it can't be long now. I have to find answers. Get to the bottom of this matter. I understand Ariadne and what is happening to me. That's a lot to unpack. Tell me you understood. I need to find the next recording. Right, well... While we're searching for that... Oh, we're doing stuff. Oh! All right. I was going Hello. to investigate this, but uh anybody there? Maybe it's a terrible idea. I don't hear anything in there. Let's see what happens. I saw after I found Husha. Wow. 
the interview room with Ariadne and Berenice. Wow. <clears throat> uh, God, this room, I've been here before. How the hell is that even possible? We are well past <laughs> what is or is not possible. Uh, turn of the century psychiatry books. I'm afraid they're as useless to me now as a treatise on astrophysics. Actually, that might have helped you. <laughs> Should I take this drawing and save my collectible for later? Oh! Ariadne's lost drawing. A depiction of a scene that must take place. That must take place. Okay, that is the dark figure with Daniel and Ariadne in her present condition. Wow. All right. Keep this. Not particularly happy about that, but we will. Now, can we open this door? No, I... I can't open this door. All right. What else do we have around here? Well, there's only... Door left. And we're going in. Hmm. Okay. Uh, what the heck is happening in here? Oh, this is like a, uh, a mail room. Uh, what is this? It looks like some sort of steam-operated control panel. Now we're down here. Okay, is that good? Now we're down there. G good. We did it! Looks like I managed to unblock the tube system. Great, I'm gonna send stuff to the director's office, apparently. This tube system is honestly quite surprising. I'm afraid the needle broke in half. Well, it just so happens I happen to have a needle. Oh, look at that! All right. The phonograph works. If I find a wax cylinder, I can use this to play it. Cool! Recording three of Berenice Prestigard. A hard wax cylinder with needle engravings. <laughs> I need to find a phonograph that still works if I want to listen to this. Well, this is the last recording. I hope I find something useful. It's time to go back in one more time. Dr. Prestigard, you've been lovely. And it's time to end this. This place, that thing, the presence, that's what Argos Legrand called that horror. Now I know why. It's anywhere the song is. In the hospital, in Ariadne, in me, everywhere. The present. Maybe there's no solution. Maybe it isn't something you can just end. But maybe... Cut it off from everything, from... from this world. Burn the bridge. Return the song to whence it came. If I take the box to that place, if I leave it there, with the presence, I need to push forward just a little longer. I need to understand. I need to put an end to this. I... I need to go... there. We're going there. I need to know. I need to make it. The third dream. We're going right in.
The universe is unraveling around us. Ariadne, do you need my help or do I need yours? It's time to go in. Oh. The wall is deteriorating, giving way to something else. To some place else. the road to the stronghold of the presence. We return the music box to there. The music box has the uncanny ability to kind of show up. Would that seal it off? And would the presence become aware of what our plan is if we walk in holding the music box? This is remarkably deep, by the way. Both metaphorically and you see how, how far she's going. this. I can't turn back now. Ariadne is aware of this place, but ha has she been here specifically? Okay, what is this? Maybe if I turn out the lantern. But isn't that me? What will happen if... If I turn it off? Should I turn it off? Going all the way there. I'm so sorry. <gasps> oh shit. Shit. I'm running out of time. All right, so her plan did not work. Well, she also didn't have the music box in that moment. Ariadne was right. She was right about everything. You mentioned this, Daniel. I've seen it with my own eyes. Even if it was in dreams, it's true. That place, the presence. I know what I have to do. Now that I'm awake, I need to... I need to get the music box and find a way to take it there. Yes. I solved this riddle. Now that I'm awake, I can put an end to this horror once and for all. Now that I'm awake, I can... I can... awake. Oh! This is it! The finale! We're going there! <laughs> Alright, that is absolutely going to be marvelous, and that'll be, of course, the next video. I can't wait for you all to join me there. Thank you so much for coming with me. Wrap your claws around that like button. Click on Dr. Fires to subscribe, and I'll see you there.